Hi, welcome to Mr. Techpathy Tutorials. Scope of this tutorial is creating a live USB creator. In this session, we will learn the procedure to prepare a live Linux USB creator using universal USB installer software. In earlier days, we used to install Linux using a bootable CD or a DVD. Nowadays, these are outdated and many are using bootable USB drives for installing Linux operating system on their PCs. Linux distributions. Before creating a live Linux USB creator, you should first learn about available Linux distributions and choose the best available one for you. There are many Linux distributions available in open source market. Most popular and updated version is Ubuntu. I personally recommend Ubuntu or CentOS or Fedora Core. Coming to the hardware and software requirements for this task, you need a Windows XP, Vista 7 or Windows 8 PC. Note that Windows 98 or 2000 will not work. You also need a USB flash drive which is FAT16 or FAT32 or NTFS formatted. We need a PC with a BIOS that can boot from the USB. Also, we need your favorite Linux ISO image. Finally, universal USB installer procedure to follow. We'll create a bootable Linux USB drive using a freely available software called universal USB installer. First, open your favorite browser and type www.pendrivelinux.com. I will open Chrome web browser from Google and open www.pendrivelinux.com. In this page, you will find the software which is used to create a live USB creator. Here, you find a hyperlink for universal USB installer. Click on it. This will navigate to a download page. Scroll down. Click on blue download icon named as Download UUI. Save this executable on your hard drive. Now jump to the save location and execute the application. I'm going to the save location which is my C drive and downloads directory. Here you have universal USB installer.exe. Double click on it. Provide administrative permissions for installing this software. I'll give my password. Once the application starts, it will request for agreeing terms and conditions. Just click I agree and proceed. Now we have three simple steps to follow here. First is selecting a Linux distribution. Second is to download an ISO image or select the existing ISO image from hard drive. Third is flashing image to USB drive. Let's see step by step. Step 1. Selecting a Linux distribution. In this drop down menu, you have various Linux distribution options to choose. Choose one based on your requirement. For demonstration, I'll be using CentOS. Here is CentOS. As you can see, right after this drop down menu, there is a checkbox which states download link. Check this box if you don't have a pre downloaded ISO image. Say you don't have an ISO image. Check this box. Once you check this box, it will display a message, launch CentOS download link. Let the download finish before moving to step 2. Click S yes and select the folder to save the ISO image. Save this file to the hard disk. Since I have already downloaded my ISO image to my hard drive, I will select my ISO image from this path. I will click browse. Select this sent to 6.3 i386 live CD and open. Next step is to select a USB drive. Make sure you are selecting a correct letter of your USB drive. Accidentally selecting a wrong drive will lead to loss of your valuable data. So please double check while selecting the USB flash drive. As you can see, I have only one USB flash drive. I'll select this and click on create. Once after clicking on create, it will ask if it is ok to proceed. 
for me since I don't have any valuable data in my USB drive I'll click S this may take some time so please wait the installation is completed as you can see it says installation done and process is complete close it this is the universal USB drive where we have flashed the ISO image here you are with the live sent OS USB flash drive insert this USB drive into a PC where you would like to install sent OS and power on the PC PC will boot from the device and will guide you to install CentOS on your PC. Hope you have enjoyed watching this tutorial. Please feel free to comment and query. Don't forget to subscribe Mr. Techpathy videos. Thanks for watching and goodbye for now.